Hey Chris. So the message I was going for you guys is I feel that you're working very hard at something or trying to achieve some sort of goal. Like some, I don't know, it feels like you're really working really hard towards one thing right now. So if that made sense. Also, I feel like either you or a fire sign are um, letting something go. So Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. So far we have the Two of Cups and the Seven of Cups. I'm seeing a lot of love options here, but I do feel like there could be one option in particular that you could be most interested in, or maybe this is this person that has all these options and they're most interested in you. Universe, what is the energy sign of Aquarius? Okay, so we have the Ace of Swords. I feel like this person could tell you this. It could be this fire sign. We do have the Queen of Wands here. Um, but I do feel like somebody's going to really um, give you clarity on how they feel about you. Universe, what is the energy? Okay. Yeah, Ace of Wands. Okay. So I'm getting for some of you guys. Okay. So I'm getting for some of you guys. This could be like, I don't feel like it's a one night stand, but I do feel that you could be being um, intimate with somebody or this person wants to be intimate with you. They might tell you this. It could be a Pisces. Oh, well, it's also strong water energy here. And this was the energy surrounding Aquarius. Okay, so we have a ton of swords here. All right. So I'm definitely feeling like whoever this person is, is definitely looking for something new. And this could be you. I feel like they're ready, almost hearing the phrase, ready to get back out there. Like they could have gone through some sort of situation um, or something like that. And they, uh, I feel like this person wants to have fun with you, but they also feel a very strong connection. With the Two of Cups, this is like uh, soulmate energy. You guys are very much so connected, you and this person. We do have the Princess of Cups, so I definitely see this person flirting with you. Some of you guys could be flirting over text with some people, or if you do the whole... Um, tinder and shit i definitely feel like there could be someone that you match with that you feel very connected to for some of you guys it could be a sagittarius or a virgo and there's why is the two of cups here why is the two of cups here okay so you have the justice card okay so i really like this because i almost feel like a lot of you guys if a lot of you guys have been single for a while i do feel like um you could have been manifest or you've been trying to manifest in your relationship but i do feel like this is coming in for you Justice is karma, so I definitely do feel that this could be a karmic partner. It doesn't have to be, like, a bad thing, but I do feel like you guys have attracted each other for a reason. So, clarifying the Seven of Cups, we have the Five of Pentacles. So, if we're talking about money, I do feel like a lot of you guys could have multiple streams of income where you guys could be working on different ideas to bring in um, income, where you could have different ideas on how to bring in something. I do feel like the advice with that is to go ahead and move forward with it. The Ace of Swords can represent success. So I definitely feel if you have an idea, um, act on it because it'll work out for you. And this way is the Ace of Swords here. Okay, so we have Temperance. So, I'm, okay, I'm definitely feeling that there could be someone in your life, someone in and out of your life, it definitely feels like that. They could be sorry about something and they might be voicing this to you. Temperance card here could be a Sagittarius or a Libra. They can want to voice how they feel. Clarify the five of cups. Okay. All right. So they could definitely regret maybe not moving things forward with you. I'm also feeling like if this is a business situation, I do feel like you guys could regret not acting on a situation or not investing in something. Because I do feel like whatever it is, it's going to grow. The seven of pentacles here, you're going to see. I'm also getting not sticking with something. You're going to regret not sticking with something. So like whatever you're working towards, continue to work towards it. Clear by the Ace of Wands. I'm getting this weird. I almost feel like if, say, some of you guys stop working towards whatever or what, someone around you, it's almost like you could see someone else achieve what you've tried to achieve, but, like, you just stopped. So I definitely feel like advice is to, to continue, continue on <laughs> with whatever the fuck you're doing or whatever your idea is. Clear by the Ace of Wands. So we have the two of pentacles here. Yeah, I'm definitely feeling like this person is choosing you. I think this person that you're talking to could be a water sign. Uh, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. They have a lot of options, but they're choosing you. They clarify the ten of swords. I also feel that somebody could feel a little bit fucked over by this. I don't know if this person knows who you are. But somebody's going to feel fucked over by an offer that you get or an offer that you give. Maybe you choose somebody and somebody's going to feel very backstabbed about this. Okay. Clarify the Princess of Cups. Page of Cups with the um, 
Ace of Swords here. This can represent good news. So a lot of you guys be getting um, some news that you want. A lot of guys can be getting an offer that you've manifested into your life. So whether it's a job offer, a love offer. There's a lot of love here. I definitely feel like there's a water sign coming into your life. Universe, what is the advice for Aquarius? Okay. All right, so we have the sun card. So I'm definitely feeling like the sun as advice is to, for some reason, but at first this was telling me to do what makes you happy. But I'm also getting that, I'm getting see things and people right now for what they are. So that's very interesting. I don't know if there's people in your life that are kind of revealing their true selves to you, if you're getting clarity on, you know, just people around you, friends, family, could even be a um, relationship. But yeah, definitely seeing things for what they are right now is gonna be very important. Okay, so we have the King of Earth here, definitely focusing on your abundance, focusing on your own um, financial stability, just your stability as a whole. And what is the advice for Aquarius? Okay, so they just told me starting new projects, but um, we have the Two of Swords here. This is a card being uncertainty. I definitely feel that there's nothing to be uncertain about, especially if this is a like a way to make money or a way to um, promote yourself or whatever you're doing. Because I definitely see with Seven Pentacles, you're doing something. Um, don't be uncertain about it. It's almost like just saying, just do it because it's going to work out for you. So I hope that this was a good reading for you. If you would like a personal reading, there's information down below on how you can get one and enjoy the rest of your week.